What's up guys, this is Cody here, and today I'm going to be doing a quick video just basically describing the jailbreak status as well as what tweaks work with iOS 8.3. So first of all, let's start with jailbreak status. So I'm getting a ton of questions, and I guess a lot of the people on Twitter don't go through my timeline before they ask the question, which is probably not beneficial to you guys because I get the same question over and 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 over. But a lot of people are asking, why aren't my tweaks showing up in settings? Why aren't my tweaks working? This is because of Substrate. It needs to be patched, and that's gonna be patched by Ty G. It's not gonna be patched by Sork, so you don't need to bug him about it. Uh, basically, that first Cydia update, if you guys follow me on Twitter, which I tweeted out earlier today, that was to fix the uh, Cydia not knowing what device you were on. So if you're getting that issue, that's basically what the Cydia installer fixed. If you weren't getting that issue, it's still good to have the most updated version of that. So to reiterate again, basically, tweaks will start working, it will start showing up in settings once Substrate is updated and those tweaks are updated by the developers. Until then, you're gonna have a very bare minimum amount of tweaks that actually work. But I am going to show you, I think we have probably 20, maybe 25 tweaks or so that actually do work with iOS 8.3 right now. And I wanna show you what those are. But before we do that, I do wanna address the most common questions that I'm getting on my jailbreak videos as well as uh, in Twitter. So first, tweaks aren't showing up in settings. That's a mobile substrate issue. We're gonna have to wait until that's updated. Tweaks aren't working. Again, substrate issue. Uh, Cydia won't open. That is probably a bad install of the jailbreak. You can try to go into safe mode. The way to go into safe mode, a lot of people are asking me how to do that as well. You basically reboot your device and then once it's rebooting, hold the volume up button. That's gonna put you into safe mode and then you'll have to see if you can actually get into Cydia. If it doesn't work, if it fails, if it crashes, whatever, you probably need to re-jailbreak your phone. So you're gonna have to restore and then re-jailbreak. Now, if you're having issues actually downloading applications, hopefully this is gonna be something that's gonna be fixed with the patch as well. And that's gonna be from Tai G. Now also keep in mind that the new patch from Tai G is not going to be something that you're going to have to restore your device and then re-jailbreak. This is gonna be something that's gonna be pushed through Cydia. So hopefully it's gonna either be pushed as an essential upgrade or it's gonna automatically populate on your device under changes. So you'll actually see that once you open up Cydia and you'll just be able to install it and that's going to fix the substrate issue. So those are the most common questions that I've been getting on YouTube as well as Twitter. So at this point, let's take a look at what tweaks are actually working on iOS 8.3 right now. All right, so here I am on my Mac, and basically what this is is just a list of tweaks that are working with iOS 8.3. Of course, I'll put a link in the description below for you guys to just click on. This is actually a dynamic list that's ever-changing. So people are actually testing tweaks, seeing if they work, developers are updating tweaks and making them work with iOS 8.3, and when those changes are made and they actually work with the jailbreak, then they're updated in this list. You can see this is a pretty comprehensive list. We have all the working tweaks right up here at the top. We have unknown tweaks right here we also have a few no's and then we have some partials as well as right down here we have a ton of no's as you can see right there now this is going to jump up uh, based on the mobile substrate being updated by Tai G but until then I would recommend just bookmarking this page or favoriting it and you can update it every couple of hours or so see if some tweaks have been either updated or if they're they go from unknown to working now if you want to you can actually check these yourself any ones that are unknown you can check those yourself, see if they work. I mean, there's a ton of them, but you could also just wait for Substrate to be updated. Of course, that's going to help get these tweaks compatibility moving along. But of course, again, I'll put the link in the description below for you guys to just click on. That way you can have this and you can check it periodically throughout the next couple of days. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button. Of course, if you want to see more videos on everything jailbreak as well as everything Apple, make sure you subscribe. All right, guys, until next time. Peace. So those are the most common questions, questions, questions. Those are the most common questions.